Hello dear students. Today we will do the question number 1 and 3 of exercise 2.8 of class 5th maths world. And question number 1 is in a stadium in the match of cricket there are 84,000 people sitting in 24 rows. How many people are sitting in a row? So first of all we will write the number of people sitting in the stadium and that is equal to 84,000. Now the number of rows in the stadium that is equal to 24. So dear students you can see in a stadium 24 rows are arranged in circular form and 84,000 people are sitting in them. Means 84,000 people are equally divided in 24 rows and we have to find the number of people in each row and for that we will divide 84,000 people with 24 rows rows and we will get the number of people in each row. So our next statement will be the number of people in each row and to calculate that we will divide 84,000 with 24. So let us divide. So we have learned the division very nicely in previous questions. So here we will use the formal method of division to solve. So we will bring down the digits from the dividend one by one and we will read the table of 24 to choose the value less than or equal to a new number formed. And on solving we will get the final remainder as 0. So our final remainder is 0. And the quotient is 3500. So 3500 is the answer which we get after dividing 84,000 by 24. So dear students, 3500 people are sitting in one row. Now next let us move to question number 3. My grandfather divided rupees 72,000 equally among four brothers and sisters. How much will each get? So four brothers and sisters are there and grandfather has to distribute 72,000. So in 72,000, 10,000 rupees comes seven times. So first of all, grandfather will give 10,000 rupees to each of the grandchild. And for that, will give five notes of rupees 2,000 to each. And as 4 children are there, so each will receive 4 into 10,000, 40,000 rupees are distributed. Now 72,000 minus 40,000, the grandfather is left with 32,000 rupees. Now again he will distribute this amount and for that will give 4 notes of 2,000 to each of the child, means 8,000 rupees. So on giving 8,000 to each of the child, 4 into 8,000, so he has distributed 32,000 equally among all the children. So, now he is left with 32,000 minus 32,000, 0 rupee. So, in this informal method of division, if we see how much money each brother and sister got, Yes, each brother and sister received 99 notes of 2000 and that is equal to 18,000 rupees. Now, we will solve it using the formal method of division. So, the amount of money with grandfather that is equal to 72,000 and number of brothers and sisters that is equal to 4. So, the amount of money each will get. That is equal to 72,000 divided by 4. Again to divide 72,000 by 4, we will read the table of 4. And 4 ones are 4. So 7 minus 4, 3 is the remainder. Now we will bring down 2. And on the table of 4, 32 comes at 8. So, 8 again on subtracting 32 from 32. We are left with 0. And one by one, if we will lower down all the zeros, we will get the answer 18,000.
thousand. So eighteen thousand is the final amount which we get. So amount of money each will get is eighteen thousand, and this answer is same as the answer we get from informal method of division. So, dear students, your homework is to do first five questions of exercise two point eight in your notebooks neatly. Bye, bye, students. We'll meet in the next video.